we'll multiply these two fractions by cross-dividing any common factors. The 6 and the 2 can be cross-divided. 6 will become 3, 2 will become 1, and here we can divide again the 3 in the denominator with this 3 in the numerator. We can cross-divide y to the third power and y to the fourth power. y to the third will become 1. y to the fourth will become y. We can also go y to the seventh and y to the fourth, where y to the seventh will be y to the third, and y to the fourth will become 1. And then the y here with y to the third here can be simplified one more time and this one will become y to the second power. And then for x, x squared divides x squared, and so those will just become the number 1. We have x to the fifth and x. This x will divide away, and x to the fourth is what's remaining here. All we have across the numerator is the number 1. In our denominator, we'll have x to the fourth and y squared. And so this should simplify to 1 over x to the 4th, y squared.